Local contingents dominated the second leg of the Tour de Filipinas 2018. Today, our riders will battle it out for the longest part of the race from Neva Vizcaya all the way to Pangasinan. After the neutral zone, your way started to heat up. Further motivating the cyclist was their warm welcome in Hueva Vizcaya. After the 567-meter elevation mark, Eman Kayadi of the Terengganu Cycling Team of Malaysia was awarded the King of the Mountain. Meanwhile, the Best Sprinter Award or Green Jersey was given to John Paul Morales of the Philippine Navy Standard Insurance. He got 21 points for the 3 Sprint Point Challenge. Today, good weather conditions heralded the race but when the cyclist reached Pangasinan, the temperature soared up to 40 degrees Celsius. Riders from the province of Pangasinan grew the stage of the race with L. Joshua Carino of the Philippine Navy Standard Insurance garnering the first place. Meanwhile, his brother Daniel Ben Carino of 7-Eleven Road Bike Philippines, who also won the Best Young Rider Award for this stage, got the second place. Mervyn Cruz of the Philippine National Team placed third. History was made after this race. Brothers from different teams snatched the first and second place with a home court advantage. Pagdating po dito sa Santa Barbara, mga last 30 kilometers, yun po, uh, sa, sa, na nag-usap kami ni Kuya na inaya niya ako na, na gumawa kami ng panibagong break. So yun, hindi kami na nakalamang kami ng mga ilang minuto. So yun, tinuloy-tuloy na namin. Tapos, Napakalaking advantage sa amin din po kasi hometown po yung Pangasinan. Napakasaya po kasi first time. Tapos dream come true na matagal namin to kasi may mga, pang, may mga idol kami na European na magkapatid. Yun yung idol namin na sana kaming magkapatid ganun din na manalo. El Joshua Carino was also recognized as the best Filipino rider. For the second time, the best team award went to the Philippine Navy Standard Insurance. What will happen on the last stage of the Tour de Filipinas? Will the Filipino cyclist continue to bag awards? Stay tuned tomorrow as we bring you highlights of the last stage of this year's the Tour de Filipinas. From Lingayen, Pangasinan, this is Desiree Jonio reporting for Panahon TV.